this is Anne Wilson, the Wealth Chef, and today's wealth snack is all about how to make empowered decisions. Now, more specifically, how do you make big decisions and have that real comfort and certainty that the decision you've made is is the choice that will take you to your wealthiest, juiciest possible life. Now, this is about making empowered choices, an empowered yes or an empowered no. Neither of those is right and wrong, but what really prevents you from living the juiciest, richest version of your life is sitting on that disempowerment, barbed wire fence of indecision, of not moving forward in any direction because one, maybe you're fearful of letting go of perceived security of the, the devil you know, or maybe you feel that you're too old to be following your dreams. You know, I get emails almost every day and social media posts, you know, and I've got all these things that I want to do and create and be and have, and I want to master my money and get out of debt, but Am I too old? You know, and I'm in my 30s, or and I'm in my 40s, and I'm in my 50s. The amazing thing is, it doesn't matter what age it is, the same belief barrier often prevents people from making a decision one way or the other about what they really want. Now, this can be a decision about getting out of a relationship that isn't serving them. It could be moving to a new country, going and having a big juicy adventure. It could be leaving a job that is giving security or some money, but really, really not lighting up. Maybe starting a new career. So it could be stopping something, starting something, changing something, leaving something, beginning something. It could be a decision about spending a lot of money. It's these decisions and how we do them that determine our destiny. It's these decisions that add up and determine whether we're going to live a rich and juicy, abundant life or a pretty so-so average life, sort of living in a little bit of scarcity and fear. And so the better we can learn how to make empowered decisions, the juicier our lives can be. But here's the thing, like so many of the aspects of our wealthy life and whether it's managing our money, actually learning how to make great decisions is something most of us aren't taught. So I'm going to give you a couple of tools to know how to make those empowered decisions. Time is mostly our most precious resource. And if you're started this year and gone, oh my, where did last year go? And you've woken up and gone, oh God, I'm in my 30s or my 40s or my 50s or my 60s. You know, how did that happen? Just know that every moment of the day just goes faster as you get older. And in no time, you're going to be waking up 10 years time and going, wow, I'm in my 40s, I'm in my 50s, I'm in my 60s, I'm in my 70s, I'm in my 80s. How did that happen? Making a fast decision and moving forward with it is absolutely key. So that's the first key distinction is time is precious. So make a decision and move on whatever that decision is. The second key, key, key distinction I want to make is that nothing is ever cast in stone. This has been vital for me to know not getting over trying to make the perfect decision. Know that whatever the decision is that you're needing to make, once you've made the decision and started moving on it, you can adjust, you can refine what you're doing. And so that is really key. And you might go, well, and maybe my decision is about, you know, leaving a disempowering relationship. Well, this comes to the third distinction. I truly believe that each of us have with inside of us this amazing sort of wealthy life barometer that gives us a really good indication of whether we're on the right track, a track that is serving our greatest good, or a track that's actually contracting around us. And the more we learn how to listen to that, the richer and juicier our lives will be. You can go and ask your family and friends to, you know, what their thoughts are on this decision. You can even post it on social media, but more often than not, that just leaves us in a place of even more confusion. And I've really learned that rather to use this tool that I'm about to teach you and to learn how to go within is the greatest, greatest compass, or should I say, sort of a yes, no tool to living a rich and juicy life. So what is this tool? I call it the TT tool. It's the time travel tool. This is when we go forward 10 years 
from now. So let's say you've got a big decision on your table right now and you're trying to decide should you go for this. You know, maybe it feels scary, maybe it feels like a big stretch leap, maybe there's a little part of you saying, mm, no, let's just play safe, you know, we know the world we're in, no, let's stick with that. what feels secure, you know, let's not rock the boat anyway, let's not go for those dreams, maybe we'll get disappointed, but there's another part of you that's really going, you know, I know, I know this is the decision and that's really great for me. So how do you know for certain? Well, you get into your little time travel machine, in your head that is, and you go forward 10 years and you look back in 10 years time to now and you go, that decision that I'm needing to make, will I regret things? Will I lose something? Won't I be able to do or achieve or experience something based on how I make that decision? If there's something I'm needing, wanting to say yes to, if I say no, what am I going to lose over the next 10 years if I don't make that decision or if I don't make that choice? Uh, if I stay in a safe job, um, even though I hate it because I feel I have to, because I'm fearful about my own abilities and what I create, what am I going to lose over another 10 years of staying in that job? Maybe there's something you're wanting to start and learn new. And, but it's feeling a bit scary for you. Go back and go, okay, if I don't learn that, and if I don't do that in 10 years, what is that going to cost me? I think you're going to find that this time travel tool is going to give you a pretty solid yes or no. If you look back and that decision is not going to have made any change in your life or shifted your destiny and your truth in 10 years time, you can go, well, actually, you're not going to lose anything, you're not going to regret anything, then you know that's your no. It's a no for you. But if you go, hmm, actually, you know, not following that dream is going to cost you a lot, that is your decision. And now you can move forward with absolute confidence. That's, this is how you let go of that waking up at 3 in the morning and go, oh, have I made the big right decision? And you doubt yourself because you've trusted who what's going on inside you. That doesn't mean that the steps you're going to take are all going to be easy and all, you know, suddenly it's going to be all unicorns, farting flowers. You know, the real key decisions that we make in our life, those real choices, those ones that make our lives really rich and juicy and wealthy in the long run, often are ones that it require us to put energy and effort in them. But that is what we're about, experiencing life. Don't lo let the perception of work put you off making a decision that you know that you absolutely need to do. I hope you found that that time travel tool is really, really useful in helping you to make empowered choices and knowing that how you make choices determines the quality of your life and how wealthy your life ends up being. You know, this is your choices with your time, your money, your energy, your focus, basically all aspects of your precious life force. So build up a strong decision-making muscle. And in the comments below this video, I would love to know how using that time travel tools helped you. If you've had a decision that you needed to make right now, you know, tell us about it. And how did that TT tool work for you? Or if you don't have a big decision right now, you know, let us share with us a, a time in the past when maybe you needed to make a big decision and what tools or processes helped you to make an empowered choice so that you could move forward confidently and really claim and design the life that you really want. And if you're watching this anywhere else than over at thewellchef.com, then head on over there because that's where all the conversation's happening and keep living a rich, juicy life.